No, like this, like this. No, like this. Not like this. Yes, yeah. How are you? Three. Machine got it. So we two men got it. Jurems. The most difficult things for me were standing in between the production crew and the nomadic people and our translator and the drivers and a lot of people involved. Even though we're a small crew, that was difficult because of the language. If you couldn't rely on your people here, then you're fucked, basically. So we experienced certain situations, especially towards the end, where it became really difficult because things wouldn't happen the way we wanted it. because you don't have access to anything you don't have with you. You just have to rely on yourself and on the crew. Okay guys, uh, we're standing here in front of a beautiful valley. Actually our camp or our nomad family is living down just at the Hoth River. And we wanted to shoot with a drone here. Which I just broke. <laughs> Holy shit quite close to our generator which also broke down in the middle of nowhere as you can see in this direction and the car broke down yesterday yes. exactly for the so third time or something third time yeah so uh, basically we are working between breakdowns <laughs> and uh, but so far everything's going well we've had beautiful shots uh, we can't complain this is uh, the risk we're taking uh, flying over to Mongolia and shooting the best video music video that the world has ever seen. <laughs> Taking risks is part of it. What about the crew? I heard there's some sickness going on. Too. Yeah, the crew, the crew's, um, I guess... The, <laughs> which is us. Which is us, the crew's us. I guess <laughs> morals are high. Uh, the physical condition of certain people is kind of low. The cameraman has been uh. vomiting and shitting all over the place the last two days. My stomach and my body um had enough of the nomadic lifestyle and traditional meals and dishes but i survived it as christina was lying uh, with a broken back two days ago i got really sick i had a lot of pain i've never had these pains before so we're a little bit beaten up after five days of traveling and living in the desert so you might be next or me, I guess. I guess me or Rob are next. Okay, cool. We needed to handle the shooting and the, our health, which is not very easy if you're out in the desert. There's no medical care, nothing. So we, we got really lucky because nobody got too sick that we needed to stop the shoot and, and you know, fly somebody into the hospital. 